Hi family, I just want to come at you real quick to um, explain the differences between, between the scalp protector and the scalp protector thick. I know um, a couple of videos ago I said, oh, I got the scalp protector thick and I was supposed to come on here and explain what's the difference um, because they both say the same thing, improve adhesion for hot and humid weather for oily skin sports and swimming prevents irritation from tapes and adhesive both say the same thing this is 1.1 fluid ounces and this is 1.4 fluid ounces so you say what's the difference beside you know a couple of more ounces from this one um, than this one um, let me tell you with this one I had and, and mind you a bottle will last for because I don't bond the back down a bottle will last for maybe uh, a year and a half you know because I do change my units um, weekly uh, every uh, five seven days about five to seven days I do take them off to give my hairline a break and um, then I reapply um, when I go back to work and you may say well what's the difference so I'm gonna show you the difference they both have the same padding at the top I don't know if you can see that both have the same padding at the top with this one both uh, scalp protectors you have to you just dab it let me get that so you can see one two three four and as you can see this is running be sure that you see that it's running there okay it's running and you do have to let it dry and you can feel something you can feel the scalp protectant on there and then you um, can put your bond on there you know whatever bond that suits you but with the scalp protector thick I notice right away you just do a dab and you see that it has like a matte finish with it um, when it dries it has like a line so it, you can actually see the protectant on your on your forehead you know right on your hairline so it's like that extra protection you know and does it hold the bonding down uh, beside the the last I used this three times and this is the third time and so far I can say it has and as you can see I just want you to see that um, it's like a layer you can actually see the uh, protector the protectant rather you know and it and you know for me it has not irritated my skin um, I like using the thick a little bit better than the original this is the original this is the scalp protector thick in the black bottle um, this I got off eBay cheap because it was um, I think it was seven 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 ninety nine plus to ship it was nine nine fifty three this I think I believe I bought it at the store for about the same price like seven nine nine over a year ago and you see I, I didn't even use half a bottle yet you know and this was over a year ago and as you can see I just started using this and you can see it's still full at the top my um, choice of scalp protector is this I like this it just for me um, I just it gives you that extra layer and you can actually see it's like a matte finish guys there um, matte so I can see that shine like right here where I placed it it's like a matte finish and you actually can put that on top your tape or your um, bond your glue for me I use the ghost bond and I use my Proflex tape on the cap
and as you can see put the makeup on and I like it my skin has not broken out you know I want to be clear um, it does say for you uh, to test it um, on your skin give a 24 to 48 hour test with anything you know because you don't know if you're hypersensitive you know you may be sensitive you know to these products where you have to use your bobby pin method or what have you but for me um, I find that the scalp protecting thick which is in the black bottle um, works best for me I got it off of eBay it's cheaper um, to get it off of eBay nine dollars I got here in like five days nine ninety six or something like that this they're both gonna protect your your hairline but this one gives you that extra protection it dries with a matte finish um, and I like it you know it, it's really good it didn't irritate my skin or anything like that so I just wanted to come at you real quick um, to show you the difference between the regular scalp protector which is in the red and the black scalp protector thick which is in the black bottle um, this is relatively new I've seen it um, maybe about a month and a half or two months you know in and this has been around for a while you know when you bond you know your hair or your units down you have you need some type of skin protector you don't want that glue directly on your skin um, because over time it'll damage your hair um, any type of glue to make it thin even I've noticed with my hair my uh, hairline is thinning a little bit like right here you know so I try to put the glue here and it, and it tells you that you gotta give your hairline a break and, and I do you know I believe it, I showed it in my previous videos you can see it's thin like right here where I put the glue and then you can see it like full here because I don't apply glue be glue so much down here because one I wear uh, lace front wigs and the when the synthetic wigs it usually stop like right here like just above my baby hair and then with the uh, human hair wigs I find that the tabs go down uh, usually all the way down here so I'll just like bond put the glue like right here just over so I don't have to worry about my edges you know so much but I just wanted to come at you real quick uh, to tell you well actually to demonstrate the difference between pro the scalp protector and scalp protector thick anyway y'all guys have a blessed night